faster. Roxen's saving, he's saving it. track. Yeah, he's yep. saving. Oh, oh no! Roxen's bike! Oh, it's oh, 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 it's shock, oh, shock is gone! Yeah, it's shock. Got... Hello, guys. Welcome to another video. Uh, last night was a weird night and the beat of a crazy night in Nashville. There was all sort of crazy things on the 250s, but especially on the 450s main event that provides us the most like weird and crazy stuff of the night. Starting with Broxen's shock explosion, there was already some news following the crash on his Instagram uh, that he will be doing some MRIs on Monday. Uh, he also says that uh, inside of the team they will be investigating what happened since according to him uh, the shock only had three hours of views. Um, and they never experienced the, uh, anything like that or any malfunction. Also, according to him, what happened was that the bottom uh, capsule or housing of the shock uh, literally exploded. So they never had that happening and they don't know as for now what caused that. So they're going to be investigating that. So I just hope that he uh, is fine and you'll be ready for next weekend as well. Another weird moment happened with uh, Sexton jumping the that section. Uh, I don't know as for now uh, if there was any miscalculation or if there was any um, problem, malfunction with the bike like would happen with the Broxen as well. So as for now, I don't have any information about that. If you know anything, you can just like share with us down there in the comments. But it was definitely a little bit weird because I don't know from the images, I'm not sure if there was any miscalculation on the jump and if he wasn't like quick enough to jump through it and then he missed something or if it was any malfunction on, on, on the bike. But let's see. Um, what comes off uh, from that if they sell it, if they tell us what was going on with it when the weekend either you like it or not uh tom Mack and the other guys aren't quick enough for jet so if you don't like him i think you have to endure him anyways i'm a big fan of tom Mack, but uh, last night wasn't the first time he wasn't straight up beaten by jet and doesn't seem like he has any answer for the for jet speed at the moment. I don't know if he is gonna have any. I hope so. That will be like better for us to watch Tomac fighting with Jet, but as for now, he doesn't have any answer for jet speed. People are always looking for the next race or the next track, uh, but we have to admit that now that the key jet is the next big thing and uh, the only one that gave him a run this year was actually Cooper Webb, mostly because he is mentally a beast, also very experienced and smart rider. Um, and let's see, three races to go. Um, they are very close on points, Jet, Jet and Cooper Webb. Um, Tomark is still uh, mathematically able, but I think that he's going to be a champion. Uh, but let's see how it goes. Hope you enjoyed the video and see you on the next one.